The Indiana Fever select Aaliyah Boston. It's been an all-star start to the career of Aaliyah Boston. The rookie Aaliyah Boston has not disappointed. She's on pace to have the best rookie season in WNBA. It is so special and it is really a blessing to have one rookie of the year. Um, it is one of the goals that I set for myself at the beginning of the season and to be able to accomplish it with God's help was amazing. So thankful for my teammates because uh, they were really able to put me in the position. Uh, thank you for my coaches because they motivated me, but this is honestly such a blessing. I'm super excited. but missed eight. You got the left-handed roll goes in. And I love it, rookie to rookie. Hey, Leaks fans, it's Diamond Miller. I'm the rookie. In You think of a lot of the newness out there from a lineup situation as well as they continue to get used to one another. On both teams, here's Juhas trying a three. And she puts Minnesota back in front. Here you see Juhas, as we mentioned, that's 6-5 from deep. knowing what to do, the veteran savvy for the former Minnesota Lynx player. Getting the angle on a Wilmike, but the three-point play goes to Dorga Juhas. As you can see, the up defense is going to lock down on her in this game tonight, but if she can have her teammates like Dorka Juhas, she was a Maryland Terrapin. She is so amped up, so competitive before she settles in. Here's Juhas, the center, finishing off the steal. Love the way Juhas is playing right now. Diamond Miller using her speed to the front court, leaves it for Juhas, rookie to rookie, she's got it. And Juhas really having a strong start to this game, we early on, efficient, and just makes a quick decision, doesn't hesitate. Just knew exactly what she wanted to do, picked off by Juhas, and here is the center leading the break, and going all the way. Honestly, we thought that she would be gone. To have her here in Seattle, to see who she is and how she works, it's amazing. This rookie's had a really nice first season. Spins, fires, and hits! That might have been the toughest shot she's attempted. Right here, boom! That is just as pretty as it gets. The horse to... Crossover, triple the one-two and lay it up and in. That is smooth as it gets, Jordan Horston. She really wants to be great in this league. Get the wide open look. And now Horston on a steal. Back, stays with it. And gets it to sneak over the front iron. As the season progressed, really good things came from her. Horston has provided some energy today. You saw her athleticism, her vision. Her ability to create plays and her versatility. And last but not least, her defense, able to defend multiple positions. Rookie with the defensive play of the game. You know, a lot of growth this year. A wall in Wilson. Austin pivoting and gets it to go. Never give up. That's right in her wheelhouse. I can understand if she feels a little pressure being the number one draft pick, but I think she thrives with that pressure. Brianna Jones has on. Brianna Jones. And Indiana's got the lead. As Boston puts on the move. Feeds Boston. Boston the shot fake. Got Parker in the air. She's automatic when that happens. Fever! There's no breathing room inside. Now the switch, and Hull gets it to Boston. Get on to it. Boston cannot be denied. She's so shifty with the move. She mixes it up. She adjusts on the fly due to where the defense goes. I love her IQ in the post. 
She has been phenomenal this season as a rookie, leading the WNBA, shooting 61% from the floor. That is why Boston. she is a top candidate for Rookie of the Year. Are you kidding me? We have Boston's numbers here for the season. Leading rookies basically in minutes played, points per game, rebounds per game, assists per game, blocks per game. I mean, just basically almost every major category. Why do you feel like she had so much success right away as a pro? She has the tools um, to be very successful in this league. I think she has the work ethic. Um, she's just gifted in so many ways, but the girl just doesn't want to lose. She wants to win every game. She wants to win every drill. She wants to win every shooting practice, you know, anything we're doing shooting. And when you have somebody who wants to compete that hard, it's hard to, to go against and to stop someone when they just have that kind of competitive spirit. Boston, quick first step. Gets oh, past Jones. Oh. Professional move. That's a tough move. There's Boston the kick out. First three point try in the game is money. I tell everybody she's a unicorn. Like AB is a unicorn. She's an easy teammate, even more better person. Boston again. Fourth right now in the early All Star voting. So just somebody that's come in. I've been so impressed with how confident she's been. I mean, Leah Boston is not playing like a rookie in this game. There's very few people that come through this lead that has the talent, uh, the mindset, and the, the willpower that she had. Leah Boston just already has been such a complete player here in the WNBA. Berger back for Boston, muscling inside, good position. Boston with a finish. Boston back in, Boston taking it at Deladon. Boston spinning, rookie wins the matchup. Fifth inside, Boston double team. Kick out Wallace, who's wide open. And the exclamation point for Indiana. Pass to Christy Wallace in the double team on the block. What? <laughs> Trying to draw the charge instead. Layup for Leah Austin. Ten turns. It leads to the layup. Zoom pointed out that she's putting up the same number she was putting up at South Carolina. And this is another level. As number one draft pick, uh, as a rookie, the heat that she was getting, you know, just, just behind her name and her coming out, for her to handle that with such grace and every game show up and show out for us, the sky is the limit for her. Boston backing it on Jones, good position and puts it in. Boston the put back, it's a two point game. Baseline out to Boston. Boston will hoist and send us into overtime. So I was like, just be available and then Everybody was like, shoot it, and then John Cole came out of my face, and then I took a bounce, and I was like, oh gosh, and I was like, I shoot it, and so I shot it. But I did hold my follow through. You sure did, and I feel like we won a championship, okay? <laughs> Why are we celebrating? <laughs> so was the fanfare something that you expected? I didn't expect it um, right away, but I mean, it is a blessing. And it's just really nice to just continue to see the support um, now that I'm in the league. Hearing that I was gonna start the All-Star game as a rookie was actually like a shock. Like I had no idea. I didn't even think that it was possible coming in as a rookie. I knew you could be an All-Star, but I never thought about being an All-Star starter. Um, it was it was an amazing feeling though to go to Vegas and, and be in that game. Well, she has been phenomenal this season as a rookie leading the WNBA, shooting 61% from the floor coming off of an All-Star starting appearance in Las Vegas. Here is Carrington, gets inside, had it blocked. I mean, Aliyah's amazing and it's honestly so impressive to see what she's done this year. And she came in and she's playing like a vet. Aaliyah Boston knew where she wanted to get as soon as she touched the ball. So smart. Aaliyah Boston back to back buckets. Obviously the number one pick, there's a lot of pressure, a lot of expectations, and she played like there wasn't any of that. So she leads the league in offensive rebounding and field goal percentage. We're not talking rookies here. We are talking the WNBA. Just a stunning rookie season on balance here for Aaliyah Boston. As far as a rookie can, vintage yeah. Boston here lately. Boston finishes there with a jump shot over Okawa. Deep position and the finish. Beautiful, it doesn't get any better than that. Erica Wheeler sets up Aaliyah Boston. There's a bread and butter for Boston. <laughs> Boston smooth from the mid-range. And as you can see,